Hi, this is Tanya. Happy New Year's. Just wanted to take a couple minutes and talk about New Year resolutions. I don't have any resolutions. The reason I don't is because I don't believe in them. It's nice to make yourself promises. It's nice to make your, give yourself goals or have something to look forward to. But in my experience, and this is just personal, but in my experience, um, they don't work. I mean, think back to how many resolutions you've had over the years. Every January 1st or December 31st, you make all these big, wonderful plans of things you're going to change and give up and do better. And let's face it, you might for a day, a week, or a month, and then... You just kind of go back into old habits. And so I don't make resolutions anymore. I look forward to the new year. I look forward to things that I want to do this year. And I try to live my life to the fullest every day. So one of the things that I want to focus on this year is to continue to take care of my health as number one, take care of my family and my businesses, but those are my focuses. But that should be my focus all the time, not just more intensely on January 1st, 2nd, or 3rd, and then slowly waning down. Um, there's a new network, the OWN Network. It's Oprah's new network. And I was up on December 31st with a neurotic dog who was going spastic because of the fireworks. So I had the TV on and they were doing some previews. This is what's coming up. And Fergie was on there and she was talking about her new show and how she's going to be talking about, um, you know, things about herself and her health and her family. And one of the interesting things she said, again, you got to remember this is 12, 31 o'clock on December 31st, is she said, you know, that warning they give you when you're on the airplane is to put the life mask on yourself before you take care of your children because if you're not healthy enough, you're not going to take care of them in, an amount of, in the place of an emergency. And that really hit me. And um, I, I think she had a really good point there. And so many times we put other things in front of ourselves and our health. And we can't take care of other people if we're not taking care of ourselves first. And that's on so many different levels. That's our health, exercise, food, um, mental, <laughs> mental health, uh, stress. You know, that's a big one for me. And I know that when I get stressed out about work or projects that I feel like aren't doing so well, I usually take it out on my family. And that's not healthy for me or them. So I get more quick to snap and, you know, um, so my focus this year, you know, put that life mask on myself again this year. I really did well last year because I was having so many changes um, and losing all the weight and trying to figure out how to really live well past gastric bypass that I need to continue that. And I hope that this year I can help others. That's one reason I'm really going to be stressing my website, Life It Not Diet. Uh, dot com this year because I want to help other people and it's a work in progress I mean I have so many revisions planned for that website over the next couple months so if you go there this week it might be completely different next week because I want to try to put a lot of information on there not just my video vlogs and my blog and and the book I'm working on but also just really have the information out there I know there's tons of other sources um, and there's other support groups and there's other really great resources but use them um, we'll kind of connect up with a network of people this isn't something to go through alone and if you don't have a forum in your area then utilize the internet it's a great resource so that's it 
Um, I'm going to focus this year on things that I think are important, and I hope that everyone has a great, healthy, and safe, and wonderful new year, and I look forward to um, connecting with you all via the internet, and uh, you know, have a great 2011.